Hello friends, welcome to Otica Medtronics company. Uh, today we are going to demonstrate how to use Otica portable family nebulizer. Uh, this is a very compact and uh, family used nebulizer uh, designed and developed by Otica. And you can see uh, the machine is coming with uh, 18 months of warranty and this is how it looks like. Okay, so we are going to first have an unboxing of the product. You can see they have given uh, first of all, this is the mask set. This is the extra filter. This is the main unit. This is quite heavy and a sturdy machine. We will keep the box aside. You can see uh, in the box uh, these are the products which is coming. Right there. Okay, uh, so this is the main unit. Uh, we are opening this product mask. Okay, so this is the nebulizer kit user manual. This is the main nebulizer chamber. This is the flow regulator you have to put on this here. But uh, for reference, we are just giving the water inside. So make sure you are putting the water after removing this. So we are just adding some water as a reference. Otherwise, you need to take the. You have to make sure that you have to keep water in between minimum and maximum marking and then we will apply this flow adjustment controller on the mask uh, this is the main machine you can see you can change the filter from here you just need to remove this now you have to remove the old filter from this and you can add a new filter from this four extra this is the air inlet filter provided to give the pure air inside of the compressor and that pure air will be going to connect to the patient. This is the connection. You have to apply this tube on this connector and the other part of the connector will going to connect on the nebulizer chamber. So these are the two masks and one more. Uh, this is the mouthpiece. You can take directly nebulizer inside of the mouth or else you can connect the pediatric mask or else you can connect the adult mask so this is just uh, you can use it with a different different size you can apply it and make sure this is the flow adjustment valve you can control the flow, flow speed of the flow from this make sure there is no water inside of this place you have to insert the medicine by removing this and you have to insert the medicine in this hole and then you have to cover this controller okay now we are going to connect the machine to the power cord and you can see we have connected now there is uh, one switch on the back side you have to switch it on on this side you can see machine has started and you can see this is the flow is coming and you can control the flow from the this, this is the minimal flow and this is the maximum flow and you just need to rotate this rotator according to your requirement if the baby is taking the uh, tube you can keep it on the slow side and if there is idle you can keep it on the higher side. this is the higher side you can see or else you can also connect the mouthpiece if you want to take the tube directly to the this is how it looks like you can see i am rotating it on this way so you can come to understand this is the fuel coming from the machine and for better life we recommend to use machine for 30 minutes and then you rest it for 30 minutes so it will be a longer life and this is a very durable machine you can depend on this machine thank you for watching